is up boys and girls and everything in between it is amazing hd here and welcome back to some more pokemon alpha sapphire randomized nuzlocke so guys um first things first i want to apologize if the face cam looks a little bit bad for tuesday's episode i messed with some of the color corrections and i forgot the settings that i originally had and uh, just a bunch of just color correction issues. I'm trying to make a C920 look really good. Hashtag I need to upgrade to the Brio. Um, but <laughs> hopefully I did a little bit more uh, fine and tuning. So hopefully it looks okay. I know I got a fugly mug. So I try to make it look as good as possible. So hopefully this looks okay for you guys. Uh, but anyways, welcome back. It is Thursday. It's a beautiful, beautiful Thursday day, and we are going to do a quick team recap here. We have Sokka of the Water Tribe rocking Water Gun, Tail Whip, Mud Sport, and Mud Shot with that Water Absorb ability. And then we have Ace rocking that Tackle, Growl, Quick Attack, and Wing Attack with the Intimidate ability. And then we have Riku rocking the Pursuit, Bullet Punch, Quick Attack, and Leer with the Technician ability. And then we have Karen, God she took the kids, rocking Screech, Astonish, Astonish, Mud Slap, and Magnitude with that Sand Veil ability. And then we have Ramen rocking Astonish, Constrict, Acid, and Ingrain with the Suction Cups ability. And then we have Maria rocking Powder Snow, Bide, Icy Wind, and Play Nice with the sl Snow Cloak ability. That is the team, ladies and gentlemen, I just now realize Riku is weak, so let's get a nice little super potion on him, which we have one left, so uh, put it into good use there, okay? And what I will uh, be going through here is we're going to be taking on the gym to get the knuckle badge, okay? So... Anyways, guys, just a reminder, any person that comments on this Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday episode, please, guys, I will be naming Pokemon after you guys next week. So anyone who comments, just know that it's the week behind. I just, I hopefully I want to stress that out enough. Um, so, because I bulk record, so I literally just sit down one day, record all three of these, edit them, and then set them out for the week. So honestly, I don't know what's going to happen in the future once these are posted, but please guys just know I bulk record. So I bulk record all three of them and then I will edit them and post them and then kind of see the updates roll in throughout the week. Um, eventually, when I actually have more time, I probably will record them each like the day that they come out. That way, I don't miss anything from you guys. But unfortunately, that's the time constraints I have now. So again, without me droning on ever the beginning of every episode, um, question of the day. Who is your favorite gym leader? Like absolute favorite gym leader you like going against, you like their team, you like them as a gym leader. Who is your favorite? You know, like who is like just OG. Oh, you're like, I love going to that gym. I love fighting them. I love them in either the anime, the just whatever favorite Pokemon gym leader. Okay. See, I even got the Pokemon trainer shirt on. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and get this knuckle badge a going. Okay. So, okay. The, I forget they have big intros now. I'm Brawly, Duford's gym leader. I've been churned through the rough waves of these parts and I've grown tough using the cave at the outskirts of this town as my training ground as well as using the equipment in this gym. So you want to challenge me? Let me let me see what you're made of. Okay. All right, dude, calm it down. I honestly have to think who my favorite gym leader is, like out of all the gents. Um, I kind of just, oh, he's gonna send out a core fish. Hashtag Ryan King Corfish down in the comments. Hopefully, what level is he? I I would think that he's still okay. Level fourteen. That's fine. Um, I don't really have anything that's. I'm just just go. I'll go just into um into Riku because I want to get Riku and Ace up to a very high level because they're gonna put the team on their back for right now. Um. 
So yeah, let's let's send out Riku Aqua Ring. Okay, so that's just gonna heal himself, uh, but hopefully a bullet punch will actually just kill him. Like just one shot him. Sorry, Ryan. One no, that's that's not even a one shot. He's a bulky boy. Oh, because it's not very effective. Okay, so we'll have to use something else besides a steel tap. I should have, you know, just been smart and known that steel is not very effective against water. So, that's my bad. So, we'll use a pursuit. That should do quite a bit. Oh, he's going to outspeed? What is this core fish? Outspeeds with water shuriken. He's probably going to hit like three times again. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Four times. Yummy. Five times. Okay. Wow. And the crit. Five times with the crit. No, oh, wait, he's not dead. Okay. Um. Wow. Uh, we're actually gonna have to switch out because I don't think I have. Um, I have a super potion. Uh, but what I think I'm just gonna do is switch out into Ace. Um. So switch out into Ace and see what we could do. Um. Honestly, if I would have been smarter, I could have could have landed that play. He's probably oh, he's gonna use a super potion. That's great. That's cool. Um, but we're just gonna wing attack. That should do, that should do a lot. And oh my god, vice grip. Okay. So we're gonna uh, just finish this off with a quick attack, and then uh, we should be good to go here. So wow, already right off the bat, Ryan the Corefish just decided to own us. Just decided to own our Skizzer. So. Full Corona. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna stay in the ace. Okay, stay in the ace and hit that wing attack. Um, and one shot. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye. Get out of here. Okay. I, I don't need that negativity in my life. All right. I don't need that fire bug. Okay. Uh, War Turtle, okay, um, let's switch back in Sokka, and, uh, switch back out in Ace, cause War Turtle, it's a decent Pokemon, but as far as Ace goes, um, he's not gonna, not gonna have too much of an issue with this. Um, and so we're gonna switch back out into Ace, and we should be able to tank any hit that comes our way and it's always good I like switching back into that intimidate uh, it's gonna use a taunt okay that's fine uh, we're gonna fall for it but it's not like we're gonna use anything else besides a wing attack here oh and he's we're gonna prop that berry what is it citrus a chocoba okay the Wally not Wally um what is this gym leader's name again? I totally forgot. But anyways, he's got the strats, all right? What is his name? Um, I know it's the Knuckle Badge. Why am I forgetting his name? Oh, well, it'll come to me. It'll come to me a little bit later on. Sokka wants to learn Slam. Let's see what let's see what Sokka knows. Water Gun, Tail Whip, Mud Shot, and Mud Sport. Uh, let's get rid of Mud Sport. We, we don't need that. Uh, that doesn't really do much for us because we're, you know, we're, we're not really, uh, effective. Okay, Crobat. Um. I'm gonna stay in the ace, uh, just because Crobat is not that nice of a Pokemon. Um, I've personally had a Crobat, Dracula, and he's carried me through some walks. Um, oh, and Toxic Spike. So, yeah, we're not going to switch back out anymore. I didn't want him actually getting set up because this guy is a speedy boy. But Ace made quick work of him. Okay? So, we're just going to be pretty overleveled with Ace, which that's going to be fine. Um, I, we definitely need a... You always need a Perlion. Okay, that's, that's fine. You always need a Backbone on your team and a Lock. Um, I just... That's what I always think. You just kind of need that strong, like that just strong backbone that's like over leveled than the other ones. Because like, yeah, it's cool to like 
equally level up all your Pokemon, and I think that's good. Like, I'm not saying that you need to train up one Pokemon, but you need to have a Pokemon that's, you know, kind of set up. Um, that's like kind of like the next level above the rest of your Pokemon. That way he can just be that core backbone. That way, like, you can just switch into him, but you know it's going to be safe. You know it's going to be fine. Um, and then kind of just make sure you focus on your other Pokemon as well. Uh, whoa, whoa, you made a much bigger splash than I expected. Okay, you got me. Take this gym badge. Timestamp me. We got the shiny, shiny knuckle badge, all right? Look at that. Uh, it's Brawly, okay. The Knuckle Badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30, even those you get trades obey without question. Hmm? You know what? I think you can make full use of this too. I'm sure this will help your Pokemon bulk up muscles. Oh, sweet. Bulk up. That's great. That's just what we needed, alright? Uh, bulk up temporarily enhances the Pokemon's muscle power. The move boosts both attack and defense stats of the Pokemon. I can see your talent becoming a giant wave that causes a storm of astonishment with trainers one day. I look forward to the day when I can surf your giant wave. By the way, have you been to the Granite Cave? It is located to the north of this town. It's full of fascinating stuff like rare stones and wall paintings thousands of years old. My friend Steven rushed to the cave after I told him about it. So that's cool. Uh, now we'll just have to kind of slowly go through all the treadmills here and heal up and head to that cave. Uh, hopefully we can make it to Slateport City and get some encounters there. So I think we can actually get a couple. Uh, I think there is a route fishing spot and then a Slateport fishing spot and then the route right above it. I want to say, or we could probably get two routes because we can get that, um, I think we can get two routes or we might want to wait later for one. But uh, we have a few fishing spots coming up. Uh, honestly, the the fishing rod is very good for encounters this early on. I really recommend anyone getting it. Let's see what else we could have got besides Sunny here. Oh, that's that's cute. That is so cute, okay? Oh, we couldn't get away, please. Snatch, okay, that's fine. Let's, can we, okay. Uh, Sokka, let's just, let's just show this person who they're messing with, all right? Oh, side wave, okay. Please, please, okay, whew. Sokka, you can hold your own. No, no, you can't, okay. Um, 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 okay. Uh, we're just, we're gonna switch into Ace and then we're gonna run away. Sorry, sorry, Sokka. Uh, your boomerang didn't do that much damage, okay? So intimidate, and uh, you're gonna snatch? Okay, that's fine. Uh, can we run now, please? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you kindly. All right, so let's go down here. Okay. Okay. Y you know what, Pokemans? All right. Oh, it's such it's a new mole. He's so cute. I would have been actually really happy with a uh, with a new mole on this one. Oh, Ember, that's fine. Okay. Uh, please don't burn. So, whatever. We're just gonna go ahead and water gun because... Okay, growl. Thanks. Thanks, buddy. I love Numel's cry. I'm not even gonna attempt it, but it's it's just... It's so cute. It's like... Aw, aw, aw. Okay, I attempted it. But look at it, it's so cute. Aw, 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 aw. I love it. Okay. So, now we'll go through Steven's uh, long, droned out... Um, thing here, so enjoy. Well, enjoy what this game has to offer for primal evolutions. It's like funny how they just thought they can add a whole new portion to the cave that just wasn't in uh, Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. That they can just be like, oh, here you go. Totally new addition to the game. Just this just got carved just recently. Like, and they just totally took out Granite Cave. Mm hmm. So the ancient world, their primal forms once ha held this much power. The super ancient Pokemon, what terrible strengths. But this appearance here, it seems uh, somehow different from Mega Evolution. Hmm. Seems my questions will not be answered today. Hmm? You are... Oh, I see. It's a pleasure, Chris. My apologies. My name is Steven. I'm interested in rare stones, so I travel here and there. Today, my journey brought me here, but what about you? Oh, a letter for me? 
Okay, this is this is droning on. Uh, why, thank you. I must have been some trouble to track me down. I suppose I must repay you in some way. Let me see. I will give you this TM. Please accept it. It contains my favorite move, Steel Wink. That'll be good to teach to Ace. Um, that, that will be real good, okay? Uh, if you don't mind me asking, do you feel anything in particular when you look up at this wall? A primal world lost thousands of years in the past. A legendary Pokemon of tremendous power became humanity's greatest threat. The terror aroused by that power is clear to see in this ancient artwork. Yes, but not all power is terrible. Your Pokemon are clearly quite capable as well. Looking at you all together, I think that you have what it takes to become a Pokemon League champion, as long as you keep training, that is. Good luck! I must be going now. Thank goodness, okay? You, you talked forever, Nancy. Um, ooh, can we get, I think, is there is there an item? There's got to be an item in one of these. Nope. Nope. There, there has to be an item here. Nope. And nope. Okay, I I was wrong. You know, if I was a game developer and I just had a cave with just artwork and all I needed from it was a uh, cutscene, uh, that's just that's not what I that's not what this is about. Okay, great. Hopefully this is another new mole because okay, it's a Porygon. Okay, we're definitely gonna have to switch out because Sokka ain't faster than a Porygon. Okay. And thanks for your water absorb there, buddy. Um, let's just switch into Ace, and then we shall run away. So we don't need to worry about this Porygon. Um, so yeah. So uh, I think what's going to be next is we're going to sail over to Slateport, and then we'll get some encounters there and kind of... Uh, yeah, get some encounters there, hopefully some good new additions to the team for some balancing out uh because i the team is pretty the team's pretty okay but i would like a little bit more diversity you know you know what i'm saying chat or why did, why did i say chat but you know what i'm saying peeps okay and guys let me to let me know too if you guys want me to like live stream any games oh it looks like you have delivered your shit what is that word your shit, good and proper. <laughs> ah, but the, that reminds me, I've had a message from the President Stone saying he has another favor to ask. It's about them Devon parts that you recovered from him before. Seems though like they should go to some fellow called Stern at Slateport Shipyard. The old sea dog will see you there safely. Oh, this old sea dog will see you there safely. Way anchors were for Slateport. Um, yeah, we'll go th that way. Uh, Slateport City it is anchors away. Pico, we're setting sail, my darling. Dude, Mr. Briny is so extra. I love him, though. He's such as like a genuine old soul. Was that supposed to, okay? I was like, was that supposed to show us sailing or just what? Ahoy, we have made land in Slateport. I suppose you're off to visit Captain Stern and deliver those parts. Okay, so we got this little patch right here. I want to say is oh, we gotta wait, wait for it, wait for it. Um, there, it's going to make a cutoff here pretty soon. Uh, we found a PP up. Oh, that's, that's just lovely. So right now this is route 109. And then I think up here, it goes into slate port, but I think, Ooh, I know before you used to actually be able to fish in slate port itself. Uh, but I think they got rid of that. I'm going to say. So we only have a Route 109 encounter, I would I would like to... Oh, actually, actually, has our life... Has, am I lying? Am I lying to you, all of you right now? We need to figure something out. Um, as far as what the routes are. So this is Route 109, okay? Um, so Route 1... Can, okay, and can we get... Hold on, Experimental... Can you sneak up on these guys? No? Okay. Yeah, there's there's no way to sneak up on them. Okay, so I need to go back to wherever this is because I thought you could always get an encounter here at Slateport. Um, yes, so, set back to Duford. Okay, please. Thank you. Because I want to go back out to that fishing spot, make sure that we're not getting a double 109 encounter because I always thought... 
Oh, maybe it was just the, the Slateport City in... Okay, we... Okay. I think I'm starting to remember, uh, but it's getting kind of blurry because there's a lot of entwining fishing spots where, like, you go, like, 10 feet and then you're in a different route right here. So, um, okay, yeah, we got to go around the house. So, I think this is Route 109. This Oh, this is, okay, 107, right? Okay, that's fine. 107, and then it goes to 109. Okay, that's, that's fine. So, 107, and then I think it goes Dufer Town, and then what is it, Route 108 up here, I want to say? Oh, I am so sorry that I, I made us backtrack like this, but... Okay, Route 106. Where Where's Route 1... Okay, so I guess Route 108 is just in the middle? Uh, okay, that's fine. So now we I know we can get a Route 109 encounter. Sorry about that. I just wanted to be... Um, I wanted to be sure. I wanted to be sure before we fished and got an illegal mod because ain't nobody like them illegals, all right? Nobody likes some illegal Pokemans. And, oh, I gotta get, I gotta get some Mountain Dew. I'm, I am quite parched, okay? Ah, yeah, that's just what you guys wanted to hear. Oh no. Oh no. Karma came and bit me in the buttocks. So yeah, I my controller doesn't is not working for Citra. Okay. Can we can I go over here and Okay, yes, I can I can use this. Okay, so I can use this. I'm gonna save real quick and restart my Citra. Please bear with me guys. I will be right back. Okay, we're back and so sorry about that kind of controller mishap. I don't know why, it's just kind of been going on the fritz here lately. Um, so what I think we're going to go ahead and do that I want to is I'm going to go right here to our prime. I'm going to guess this is a prime fishing spot here. We're going to get a Route 109 encounter. Um, I mean, it, it's, it's for a legendary, so it's not going to buy it on the first one, but the second one. There it is, and we're gonna get ourselves a nice, juicy legendary. Okay, Leopard, that's... That's fine. Um, I could take a Leopard. Um... Actually, you know what? I don't even want... I don't even want a Leopard, okay? We're... It just... Alright, we're 10 levels above it. I... I doubt that this thing will be able to take on Sokka at all. Um, but I'm going to just, yep. Yeah, so two water guns, we should be good to go. Sokka should be, uh, but if it keeps using growl, we're going to have to use, yeah, we're going to have to use, uh, three of these water goons. Uh, but so this is no big deal for Sokka. Um, I guess all it has is growl. That's just great. So that was our route 109 encounter. So that was cool. That's that's just what we wanted. Um, so anyways, guys, what I think I'm going to do is just uh, I'm going to do a nice little quick montage of uh, trainers here. Uh, but we're going to hit up the we're definitely going to hit up the, uh, the Pokemon Center, get some supplies and uh, get a fresh set of heels. And then I will start the montage. Actually, I'm gonna just start the montage with all that in it. So, anyways, guys, see you, uh, see you soon. Yeah.
Okay, and we're back. All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed that montage. We got Sokka up to level 19, which coming to fruition, I just never remembered. He evolves at level 20. So, to, like, next episode. So, on Saturday, we will be getting ourselves a Quagsire. So, that should be really fun, guys. Hopefully, I can find a way for a slate port encounter and then the route above encounter. Um, and then we should be taking on some more of Team Aqua for the Devon Good or the the Devon Good parts or whatever they're called. But I just want to pause. I I remember something really really funny uh, from the montage, and I, I just want to come back to it and put emphasis on it. Um, watch guys, watch Yuxi's fainting animation. Just let's go ahead and cut right back to that. So isn't that funny? He's just like no and then he dies that is just freaking classic so i just i just saw that and i thought it was funny and i just wanted to put a little bit more emphasis on it guys so that's gonna go ahead and wrap up today's video so uh hopefully you guys all enjoyed um please just you know questions comments concerns put that down in the comments section just let me know that you guys are watching and enjoying it please smash that like button hit that subscribe button if you haven't already to become part of the family we are a family here you guys just aren't just subscribers i would truly truly do mean that and then anyways guys if you want a pokemon named after you put that down in the comments as well we have a few encounters coming up so if anyone wants to get a pokemon nicknamed after them please let me know uh, down there and then guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you saturday peace see you again